Question 9. The following figure shows a circle, sector O. The circle is there. Part A. Determine the equation of the circle. Determine the equation of the circle. So look at this circle. For us to get the equation of the circle, we need to have the center and the radius. So we need the center and we also need the radius. So how do we identify the center? The center is O. We just need to give the coordinates of the center. And when you give the coordinates here, the coordinates will be 1, 1 1.5. This is 1.5 here and this is 1. So the coordinates are 1, 1.5. That is the center. 1, 1.5. The radius will be this distance from the center here to the circumference. So how many units are those? So it is from 0 or from 1. You're very keen. From 1 all the way to 3. So those are 2 units. So radius is equals to 2 units. So having the center and the radius, we can now proceed and get the equation. And we need to understand the standard format of the equation of a circle. It is given by x minus a squared plus y minus b squared is equals to radius squared. That is the equation of the standard equation of circle with center being a b. The center is a b and in this case uh, a b is 1 1.5. This is 1 1.5. So you just need to substitute and you have the radius as two units. So substitute. So this will be x subtract a is 1 then you square that plus y minus b which is 1.5 squared is equals to radius squared which is 2 squared. Open this bracket you get x squared minus 2x plus 1 then plus expand this y minus 1.5 squared you get y squared minus 3y plus 2.25 is equals to 2 squared which is 4. So x squared plus y squared then minus 2x minus 3y. I'm just reorganizing these. Then the constants we have 1, 2.25, and 4. So I can bring 4 to the left hand side of the equation so that I will have 1 plus 2.25, then subtract 4. And that will give negative 0 0.75 is equals to 0. So that is the equation of the circle. Part 2, and for part 2, you're supposed to use the equation in part A to determine the x intercept of the circle correct to three decimal places the x intercept of this of, of the circle so how do you get the x intercept uh, at x intercept so at x intercept y is equals to zero so what you need to do you just need to take the equation that you have obtained and then you simply uh, substitute y with zero at x intercept the value of y is equals to zero so look at this equation I'll just use this equation that is here. So x squared uh, plus y squared minus 2x plus 3y minus 0. Point. So what you're going to do, y is there and y is there. Just substitute those values with a 0. Where we have y, just substitute that with 0. And this is what you're going to get. This will give x squared minus 2x then minus 0. 0.75. So that is what you get. When you substitute y with 0. And I can simplify this. 0 0.75 is the same as 3 quarters. So this will be x squared minus 2x minus 3 quarters. The same as 3 point, uh, 0 0.75. So let me multiply each term by 4 to get rid of this uh, fraction here. I'll get 4x squared minus 8x minus 3 is equal to 0. So when I solve this quadratic equation it will give me the x intercept and let me use um, the quadratic formula use the quadratic formula to solve this in this case the value of a is 4 which is here then b is equals to 8 and then c is equals to negative 8 so let me substitute those values here in this formula uh, so x 
be given by negative b mm, this is a uh, negative so b negative 8 b is negative 8 c is negative 3 correction them so this is negative 3 so let me substitute x is equals to negative b will be 8 plus or minus b squared is negative 8 squared which will be 64 minus 4 times a a is 4 times c everything divided by 2 times a which is 4 so this will give 8 plus or minus uh, 64 subtract 4 times 4 times uh, negative 3 you get 112 you give 112 so you get the square root of 112 divided by 8 and this one will give 8 plus or minus the square root of 112 square root of 112 will give 10.58 so you have two values of x the first value is uh, when you consider the positive 8 plus 10.58 divided by 8 and this one will give 2.323 that is the first value and the second one x is equals to consider the negative and this one will give negative 0. 3, 2, 2, 5. So those are the values of the x-intercept.